Welcome to the Tinker Mill Panel Saw. After watching all the videos, you will complete an in-person checkout to complete your Woodshop 101 certification. You will be expected to demonstrate parts of the panel saw, making a crosscut, making a rip cut, and cleaning up. Be sure the dust collection is connected and the vent is open. The purpose of the panel saw is to make large pieces into usable sizes. All wood cut on the panel saw must start at least three feet long. The longer edge should be placed along the rollers. Final cuts are better done with other tools such as the table saw. You can look at the measuring marks on the saw to determine the length of the remaining piece. Before cutting, make sure the saw is able to move its full range of motion. Move the piece into position and then bring the saw down slowly. Allow the blade to stop spinning before bringing the saw back to the top of the cut. To change from a cross cut to a rip cut, you pull on the knobs and then rotate the saw so that it cuts left to right. To adjust the height of the cut, first loosen the wing nuts, move the saw to your desired location, and then tighten the wing nuts. Use the trigger lock to hold the trigger down while doing a rip cut. Always move the material from left to right. As you get close to the saw, move to the right side and pull the material through the saw. Thank <laughs> you. 